From the noisy streets of New York to the laid-back tranquility of California, Americans are tuning out and tuning in. It's the latest fan, tiny stereo cassette players with featherweight headphones. It's caught on all over America, but nowhere as it has in New York, where more and more people are discovering that about the only space they've got is between their ears, in a manner of speaking, of course. You know, listening to Beethoven and walking in Manhattan, you know, walking on the streets is, uh, it's pretty nice, <laughs> as opposed to hearing the sirens that are going by and the jackhammers. Yeah. It just puts you in your own world all by yourself. It's like carrying your stereo with you, you know, <laughs> on, your, on your head, and it's like... Whether they wear pinstripes or no stripes, they're discovering that, at least musically speaking, you can take it with you. About 750,000 people nationwide are doing just that. Everybody's buying the machines, anyone from a wealthy executive uh, likes to spend his weekends out in a sailboat listening to uh, Beethoven, to the, the street kid listening to new wave music down in the subways. Well, this is all it is. There's a lot of noise and confusion down here, and it just centers me. And, uh, you know, I've just got to go about five stops, but it feels good. Is it the me generation gone wild, the height of antisocial behavior? Electronic snubbery. The rest of the world tunes out to me sometimes, so I might as well do it to them. Some still prefer last year's model, the radio that's about as big as the Empire State Building and as loud as World War II. What do you think? What do you, can you hear me, by the way? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what do you think of the people who wear the headsets? You know, so that doesn't make a lot of noise, and they only. I say it's different strokes for different folks. Different strokes indeed. In the midst of this serenade, there developed one of those mellow happenings that exemplify the sophistication for which New York is so admired. You bother a lot of people with that? No. Bother me. <laughs> Bothers the hell out of me. I think yeah, you're invading my life space with that damn thing. Yeah, I yeah. Am. You I are, am. really. Oh, Not only mine, but everybody else around here. I, mean, I ask everybody here, here isn't this here ridiculous? Country do, here country do. It's nice to know that music can bring serenity to people, that music hath charms to soothe the savage breast. It's really quite comforting. Well, uh, I can't take it well, uh, I life, added up the hair, I life, can't take life, it anymore. Life is but a dream. Thank you, thank you. Mark Goldberg, CBS News, New York.